Egypt may just be starting. For weeks, the people have been filling Tahrir Square and demanding quicker reforms. And these reforms have also come from secular groups. Well, that all changed abruptly this Friday, as Fred Pikin reports. It was supposed to be a show of unity between Islamist and secular groups in Egypt. Instead, the Friday rally in Cairo's iconic Tahrir Square turned into a show of power by the Muslim Brotherhood and Salafist groups. Tens of thousands turned out, and their message was crystal clear. The Islam will prevail forever. Islam is the constitution, and nothing over the over Islam laws, nothing over the law of Allah from our holy Quran. We want to reach the stage uh, that uh, Islamic religion uh, here will uh, be the, uh, the parameter or the measurement which we can be judged for. After the revolution that toppled Hosni Mubarak, Egypt is struggling to find a new order. With elections and the drafting of a new constitution on the horizon, the secular groups that led the pro-democracy protests fear Islamist groups like the Muslim Brotherhood are getting the upper hand and have Sharia law as their goal. Their spokesman denies such claims. Don't be afraid about Islamic democracy. It is a new model of democracy, adding morality, spiritual rules to the democratic tools. This will appear in few years, not in Egypt, but in the Arab and Islamic world. Until now, the mainly young and middle-class protest movement has occupied Tahrir, calling on the military council currently running the country to implement social and economic reforms faster and to get tougher with former Mubarak regime cronies. Those revolutionaries were essentially ousted by the Islamists on Friday. There is no unity whatsoever, this man from the secular group says. There are different stages with different messages. I don't know what's going on. Some of them fear a pact between Islamists and the army, but some experts believe the fear of an Islamist takeover in Egypt is overblown. It's going to shake the secular forces. It's going to be a boost of confidence for the Islamists, but again, um, it's not final in any way or uh, an indicator of where things are going. Seeing some of the opinions on display at Friday's rally, moderate and secular Egyptians hope it's not an indicator of the direction their country's headed. But clearly, the Islamic forces in Egypt have shown their power when they want to flex their muscle. Fred Plyken, CNN, Cairo, Egypt. Now these World One Day